How to Make a Bird by Megan McKinley, illustrated by Matt Otley. How to Make a Bird. You need a lot of very tiny bones. They will be smaller than you might imagine. Some so tiny, they are barely there. And they will be hollow. These hundreds of bones so light that when they rest in your palm, you will hardly feel them. These are what will float on air. Take these bones and arrange them into a bird shape. Any bird shape will do. The proud arc of an eagle, the soft curve of a sparrow. Breathe deeply and take your time. The making of a bird is not a thing to be hurried. Next you need feathers for warmth and for flight. Smooth these over the bones of your bird shape. Press them firmly into place. Save the longest feathers for the wings and the tail. These are what will lift your bird into the air. Now give your bird inside its brittle bones a heart that beats faster than any human heart. A sure steady heart to carry it across oceans and continents all the way home at the end of a long winter. Then add the final touches. The way an artist adds her last few brush strokes, her tiny signature. Give your bird sharp eyes for hunting a beak for building the nest, strong paws for gripping, a song to sing. And when you have made your bird with its bones and its feathers and its grasping claws, you might sit back in sight. You might say to yourself, I have made this bird, this silent, still shape of a bird. But when you see it sitting cold as a statue, you will know that there is more to a bird than the things you have given it. So you will gather it into your hand and cast it gently upon the air. Those wings you so carefully made will stretch out just a little and your bird will tremble as it fills inside its tiny racing heart with the dreams only a bird can dream of open sky and soaring flight and then your bird will catch your eye and you will know it is time to go and open the window open it set your bird upon the still and watch while it stretches its wings and looks around with its clear sharp eyes see it shiver as it leans forward onto the air and then takes off in a strong sudden movement soaring straight up away and away, never once looking back, until it is a disappearing speck in a vast blue sky. And feel your slowly beating heart fill with its kind of sadness, a kind of happiness, for this is when you will know that you have really made a bird. The End